coming up on your Thursday DTN3. Titan Toy Drive, Thanksgiving plans, a strike on campus, Twilight premiere, and sports coming up right now. A simple donations can go long ways. How would you like to make a child's Christmas extra special this year? With Christmas around the corner, Camp Titan, the philanthropic camp part of ASI, is encouraging students to participate in this year's toy drive. Toys will be donated to underprivileged children in Orange County. Students can drop off unwrapped gifts or gift cards at the information and services desk located in the main lobby of the TSU. The drive will end on December 8th. On Tuesday, students gather in the McCarthy Quad to protest the possible upcoming fee increases for the spring semester. Students were also chanting that if education is not made a priority, that an occupation might occur. Students began pitching tents outside the library on Wednesday. Besides Thanksgiving turkey, there is one more thing students are looking forward to next week. No school. Cristian Santos is on campus with some excited students. Cristian, what's the scoop? Hey Natalie, we only have one day left till Thanksgiving break, so what are students most excited about during their one week off? Let's go find out. I'm most excited for spending time with my family, no homework, getting a break from school. No school and just uh, spending time with family. Absolutely, no homework. I'm excited to see my family and gobble up all that turkey. No schoolwork and lots of turkey. Going on a cruise and that means no homework to think about. Well, it looks like we're all excited for no homework. I'm Chris Ann Santos, back to you in the studio, Natalie. I am definitely looking forward to no homework too. Thanks, Chris Ann. The long wait for Twilight fans has finally ended. The Twilight Saga Breaking Dawn Part 1 will open at midnight tonight and has sold out more than 2,500 showtimes nationwide so far. Fandango.com has reported Breaking Dawn represents 93% of the tickets sold so far for the weekend. And now, Monica, what's going on in the sport? Thanks, Natalie. The man known as Coach K has made history. With Duke's victory over Michigan State, 74-69, Duke won the State Farm Championship Classic and Coach K achieved his 903rd win. And more sad news for the NBA fans. More games have been canceled. The season is not on lockdown until December 15 and there seems to be no end in sight. On Tuesday, players filed a class action antitrust lawsuit against the league, moving the dispute from the negotiation table to the federal courts. That's all I have for you guys today. Enjoy your Thanksgiving break with some, of course, turkey and football. Thanks, Monica. That's all we have for today. I am Natalie Silva. Have a great Thanksgiving break, Titans.